I want to be an inventor. I want to meet Big Weld. I want to be somebody. I'm playing Rodney Copperbottom, the, uh, the, the, uh, the, I suppose the young country bumpkin robot who's, who's the son of a dishwasher and, um, in the small town and, um, his father's, his father becomes ill. He's of an inventor and he loves to invent things and he can fix anything. He seems to be very skilled as a, as a, as a fixer, a mechanic, or I don't know what, what the robot term would be. Um, and his father becomes ill, so he decides that he's going to save his dad and he's going to go off to the big city to find Big Weld, who's his hero. And when he gets there, discovers that uh, Big Weld's nowhere to be found. And, um, and, and in fact, things are going, are slipping away so that the, someone else is in charge and there are no spare parts for robots anymore and there's only upgrades. Everyone just goes, oh, well, there's nothing we can do about it, except our hero, Rodney Copperbottom, who steps up to the plate and saves the day, you know, tries to... He makes a stand. He says, no, this isn't good enough. We can't... We can't let it be this way. My mistake was hoping that Big Weld would fight our battles. Well, he won't. It's up to us. If we don't do something about Ratchet, no one will. Come on, let's fight back! It's quite difficult, um, it seems, uh, the process. You know, I'll, I'll read the scene through with the director where he's reading all the other lines, just to get a sense of the scene. And then, um, and then we'll kind of pick each line out one at a time. So it becomes quite technical. It's not, you don't have the normal flow of things, but it's so specific. It's, you're only using, I mean, I found this by doing radio work in the past, that you, when, you, when you're only using the voice, when that's all you've got to tell the story, then it, there's a kind of freedom in it, although because, because it becomes so specific, no, Somehow it kind of uh, you, sounds like a contradiction, but it kind of sets you free in a way because you only, you know, you're not worrying about anything else. It's just, uh, it's quite pure.